You're watching Skylands, the local bird's eye view. My name is Bart, and I will be your host and pilot in command of this mission. In today's episode, we are returning to the town of Ringwood, and our mission takes us to Erskine Lake and its surrounding community. Fun fact, Erskine Lake is named after a Scottish mining engineer who became a surveyor general in George Washington's army during the American Revolution, which coincides with Ringwood's long mining history. So sit back, relax, put your headphones on, and enjoy the show. consists of three major lake communities, Erskine, Cupsaw, and Skyline, but for those not familiar with Ringwood's history, none of these lakes are natural lakes. Each was man-made and has a history spanning hundreds of years. The town of Ringwood was formally established in 1918 as a vacation spot for wealthy families just before the Great Depression. But the history of Ringwood dates back to 1740 when a Welsh miner discovered large amounts of iron deposits. The town was later named Ringwood by the Ogden family. to 1771 when Robert Erskine, a mining engineer for the American company which operated the Long Pond Iron Works, joined the American Revolution under General George Washington. A surveyor by trade, Erskine contributed up to 200 maps to help George Washington's army. Unfortunately, Robert Erskine died soon after from complications of the common cold, and he is buried right here in town in Ringwood Manor. The Ringwood Company created Erskine Lake in 1927 by creating a dam at what was then called Tice's Pond as part of a real estate deal for uber wealthy families in the 1930s. At the time, dams were being built all throughout the United States. As a matter of fact, the Wanakee Reservoir was being formed at the same time as Erskine Lake. Fast forward to present day. Erskine Lake is a thriving lake community that is home to those who enjoy anything from fishing, hiking, swimming, or enjoying the great outdoors. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy the show, hit the subscribe button and wake up with us every Sunday.